Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Um, I, uh, I just, I didn't, I didn't write anything to come down here. And um, I just, I wanna speak to my colleagues who maybe we feel different about this that are women. And I just wanna tell you that I respect you. You are highly valued and I have nothing against anyone who may think differently on this bill. But I wanna challenge every man and woman in this space. This bill is simply reminding Louisiana that a male that has been a male since the beginning of time is still a male. It's simply reminding the state of Louisiana that a female that when she was born in the 1900s, that she still can be acknowledged in the same, with the same anatomy as a, as a female today. We're not, this is not hate. This is to clarify. This is to remind Louisianians that we still believe in biology. We still think that there's men and women that are highly valued. And in committee that day, I spoke about this because I do have a daughter. We have two. And I remember when I grew up and I was doing softball and I was on swim team and we had locker rooms that there was a guy's locker room and a girl's locker room. And guess what? There might've been people in that day that maybe they, maybe they identified differently. But in my time, we went to locker rooms and bathrooms and gyms where the woman could completely undress and never had to worry about a male being naked in that space. This is not about hate. This is about standing for our daughters. Do you want your seven, your 10 year old, your 14 year old athletes to feel like there could be a question for them in their high schools, in their middle schools? Children, they should have that right. And I would even say it, I should have that right when I go to the gym and I go change clothes. This isn't about hate. This is about allowing the state of Louisiana to recognize that we believe in biology and that we care about everybody. But we believe that there's still males and there's still females based on biology of what our doctors have said for years. So I just wanna just remind all of us and I pray that when we vote, that we're voting to acknowledge the sexes, the changing rooms, where people undress in the presence of others in a locker room or a shower room, that we still believe it should be just women and just men in these separate spaces. And I'm sorry for the passion, but for people that think this is not happening, you're living under a rock. It's happening from coast to coast. There are detention centers. This will protect the women in our detention centers. There are some states where they are allowing biological men in female detention centers and pregnancies have occurred. We are protecting them. This is not hate. This is not hate. So I wanna challenge you, when you vote, think about your girls. Think about biology. Think about what doctors have said when children are born. It's a boy, it's a girl. We're just coming into line with that in the state of Louisiana that says we still believe that. It's not hate.